But the question is, do you want to say bar humbug and ask your guests to cough up for their roasts Heck, on Christmas Day? That's an extreme reaction, Ben Shepherd. Uh, we've got Jane Felstead, who's hosting this Christmas and happily coughing up for her guests, aren't yep, you, Jane? I am. Uh, and Kate Robbins, who believes, no, no time to split I'm the not bill. I'm coughing up. I have no. enough of it. I mean, would you be really that brutal? <laughs> no, I, I'm, look, I'm not going to have an invoice for people when they arrive at my house saying, thanks, I'll have a tenner. <laughs> um, but I do think that in a big family like mine, um, there's millions of us, and I do think that when it's uh, whoever's turn to host, um, we ping each other a bit of money, you know? I mean, mm. that's the technical Do you actually do that? Oh, do you? Pinged. So no, 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 no. Sorry. Do you actually already you are sending yeah. money to whoever's hosting? To, Absolutely, to because help I think costs. that whoever's holding it, you know, there's so many relatives. It's going to be more than. Did you say, Charlotte, three hundred? Mm. Three hundred pounds mm. for eight people. It's going to be in our family. It's got to be. I don't know, four or five hundred quid for, for, the, for the festivities, you know. Yeah. And I just think that uh, asking your family for a bit is... Uh, well, we just do it without asking in our family, really. But uh, I mean, obviously not in though, yours, Jane. Jane, don't you think, though, that very often it is the same member of family every year? I'm thinking particularly of my <laughs> Uncle Jeff at this point, <laughs> who does the full Garraway clan on the 27th. And, uh, you know, it, it falls to them every year because maybe they've got the house that's big enough to yeah. get everybody in or whatever. And at some point, they might think, crikey, this is out of control, particularly mm. when children get married and have children and then girlfriends come yeah. along. Yeah, it I does get, get big, it is, doesn't it? I think it's a privilege. I know it's different and I know people are going to say it's OK for you, Jane, because you can afford it. But, you know, everybody has to watch money. Mm. But it's Christmas and I think any kind of... I'm not saying you're mean because I know you're not, I'm not exactly mean. where you're coming from. But if someone's going to come to my house and really kind of really sort of drink everything and eat everything, then they won't be invited again, probably. <laughs> or if they do I'm not come coming, again, then. I will, hmm. I'm, I'm going to buy them a really rubbish bottle of wine down there under the table and give them a terrible hangover. They won't want to come back. But I do believe, <laughs> I do believe that Christmas is about, it's Christmas, it's about giving and to count money and to worry about money. You just, I just factor Jane, Christmas into the rest of the year, I would really. say mm. Christmas is about giving, obviously, and, and, and to get into the Christmas spirit. Isn't Christmas about giving to those who do not have as much as you do and therefore if it's on you to do all the festivities isn't it uh, in the christmas spirit to to say you know can somebody contribute please is that i've never had to ask that what happens to me i've never asked that and i would never ask that couldn't but what happens to me is of course they do quietly i will find someone's ah, some money you see. yeah 20 quid never... here 20 so, quid and how there. does that manifest itself is it like hey saying do you actually ping it do you sort of do it in advance or is it money that's given on the day or left no, in God, the house no, somewhere no 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 that would be horrendous no, i'd never do that i mean things like one of the kids my kids are getting older thank god and somebody'll say oh by the way i'll do the turkey this year yeah. and it's hallelujah so they'll buy the turkey and bring yeah, it yeah or they'll send so it down so here you go so but you've already said Hallelujah, what a relief that someone else is taking a bit of responsibility. No, what a relief they're growing up and thinking about it. But if that they're thinking relief. about it, why not sort of address it earlier and say, OK, guys, come on, you no, need to give us 20 quid. I'd, no, I'd never address it. I'm really grateful when they take the initiative and think about me. Yeah. I mean, that's gorgeous and mm. that's part of your kids growing up. I'm never going to ask I would money. like to I go to James. I think it's a massive privilege. I'd like you to come to me. I would like to go to James. And I bet you'll like... Particularly you know she's not no. going to charge you. Not going to charge you. And I reckon at James it'll be like at Balmoral with the Queen. Do you all do country dancing? Oh, without doubt. Yeah. <laughs> I do that as I get up in the morning. That's right. I get my little tart on. But, Kate, do you... OK, so, so there is... And as Jane's pointing out, yeah. so that lots of people saying this. Uh, Ian's saying, my mum's a legend. She's prepared dinner for between 18 and 15 people the last 20 years. She hires mm. out tables, centrepieces, even down to the brandy glass and cutlery, as well as paying for the food and drink, and would never ask for a penny, just ask us to help with the dishes. Well, that's what most people do. They turn up with some puddings, or you say to somebody, mm. oh, I, I can't do mince pies like you do them. Would you make your special mince pies? And then they turn up with all the mince pies. And is that enough that's for you? That's normal. Well, no, in our family, we tend to ping each other a bit of cash. So you do it anyway. I think I mean, what a lot of people are saying is it kind of depends on expe expectations. A lot of people are un unable to say that they no yeah. longer want to host if they've been doing it for a while. And yeah. it's one of those pressures of expectations of Christmas which actually affect I all think, of us, isn't it? I think you've got to no be No one wants to be the killjoy. No, but... Um, and say, I, I think can't you can be make it very this. aware if you're not able to mm. do Christmas and you, you, are, you know, you're, you're su struggling or suffering in some way, I think you can make people aware of that. And I mm. think I would rely on their 
on their on their good judgment, on their generosity to pick up on that and say, yes. you know what, I'll do that. Mm. You're right, Jane, but let's face it, the most hard-working people in this country, most people who work long hours, find Christmas actually financially very crippling. Mm. That's mm. the reality of it. I and, I, and I understand, you know, the, the way position you're in and, you know, you probably can afford a nice Christmas and everything, but a lot of people can't. I'm not saying my family are like that, but I'm saying we have known what it's like to be skint in our family. And, and if you are feeling a little bit, oh, I haven't got quite enough, we're honest with each other Just and we upfront, say, yeah. um, could you help out with that? Could you help out with that? And I do think it's such an expensive thing. Obviously, you can go to places like Aldi and Lidl, but you go in there, go down the middle aisle, you come away with an inflatable kayak, two <laughs> Spider-Man duvet <laughs> covers <laughs> and a pizza I'm oven. That yet. And I'm talking, of turkey. I'm talking of get-togethers. Are you going to be getting together with the red naps? Because we're all on <laughs> bated breath to see if, if Harry has sorted Emily with a date with Jamie. How are we if doing, he Kate? Bungs Emily me at 20. Seven court is your <laughs> if he bungs me a monkey, I'll be even more pleased. <laughs> uh, listen, I don't know. Uh, we love you, the red naps, wherever you are. You were out oh. last night with your daughter on the red carpet, yes. OK, yeah. at the at the Millie's. Mm. She's on the front of the sun today. Is she? How is she, how is she experiencing well, life since she's landed back down? She's fast asleep. I mean, she's... <laughs> Jet I've never known anybody sleep like that woman. She's covered in mozzie bites, but uh, she's enjoying all the uh, oh. attention, I must say. Yeah, the attention, I can imagine that. And you I'm know really... Toffs, don't you? I know mm. Toffs, and she won it last year, and she, yeah. I mean, she's a good little girl. Mm. How, I mean, how... Anybody could go and do it. I'm full of admiration. Mm. You couldn't I'm... do it. No, go and eat. No, what? spiders. That eat, would make you great television, though, Jane. The That's the point, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Christmas. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what they eat near would make amazing TV. Well, I'd make, them, <laughs> I'd make them pay to eat my spiders. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they'd have to pay me to do that. Uh, okay, Jane, thank you very much for joining us this morning. Lots of people getting in touch, Charlotte. Yeah, they are indeed. And, and this one makes me laugh here because, um, oh, where's it gone? Tim on Twitter says, I gave my ex brother in law £100 towards Christmas dinner and drinks as we were staying in for two nights. But he says the food was cold, badly cooked, and the alcohol just what he liked. I'm glad my sister left him a few months after. Ooh, it doesn't always go well, does it? Happy Christmas oh, yeah. there. Uh, Claire says, my mother-in-law doesn't even bring a bottle of wine. None of the guests help with the clearing the table, the washing up. Good job I've got a dishwasher, otherwise I'd be in the kitchen all day long. Just oh. lend a hand. Everyone's got to lend a hand Christmas, surely. Not good, good. I lend a hand a bit. Yeah, I think you've got I, to stay. I think you open a can of worms, don't you, with the whole Christmas spirit. Well, no, they're extra, they are, the can of worms. <laughs> <laughs> they're about 15 quid in That's Emily's favourite Christmas dinner now, isn't it? A can of worms.